To start, I use river rocks and you could pick out the shape of the rock that you feel it fits. Uh, and I use the primer. And I coat this river rock about two to three coats. To make it easier, um, I did this uh, sketch so you could follow uh, what the front view of the deer rock looks like. And the back, just very simple, so I don't need a sketch for this. Okay, I already did the pencil sketch for the deer rock. Now I'm just going to trace it with a Sharpie marker. To start with, I'm going to mix an orange and I'm going to use the orange and mix this uh, burnt sienna or the reddish brown with the orange. Uh, and uh, here's the brown I'm going to use. All right, so let's begin by giving this, uh, I'm going to add a tiny bit of uh, brown to it. So here's some orange into this brown. Okay, now we finish the front and we add the spots and we're going to turn around and paint the back. Of the deer rock and here's the front and this is the back. Now we're all done with the painting, front and back. So here's the back to see. And the last uh, part is to seal it with the sealer. And this is what I use to seal it, to make the color more uh, bright and glossy. And it protects the paint. And I use the flat brush when you do this, um, don't use water, only use the water to clean your brush. And initially it will be white, but once it dries, it will dry clear. So just do this front and back. I mean, do the back when it dries in the front. And then you're all done. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to Art Lessons with Wendy.